Hey, welcome back to Root Letter. Uh, we're nearing the end, or this might be the end of Root Letter. I'm not really sure. Uh, it's the tenth day since I arrived in Matsui. I don't have anything left to do in the city. I take a letter out from my bag. There's still one letter I hadn't reread. It's on airplane pattern stationery. This is the tenth letter she sent me. It's dated February 27th. I read the final letter. Konnichiwa. All right. Uh, hello. Are you doing well, Max? My life is normal. It's almost time for graduation. Let's spend our short time left in high school well, and not leave any behind any regrets. People have a hard time writing their thoughts honestly. I want to gather up my courage to write it, but I don't have that courage. I'm sorry. I have Femina. Hmm, that's a very vague letter. What sort of reply was it that I wrote? Uh, thank you for your letter. I'm doing well. I feel like I write that line a lot. I don't have any regrets in my high school life, but I wanted to do more. I might even cry at the graduation ceremony. More boys and girls were crying at my middle school graduation. When I told them not to cry at the graduation of all places, they just glared at me. It takes courage to write important things. It's scary to think that if you write it, that'll be the end. Yet yeah, it's so easy to write on and on about trivial things. I still don't have the courage to write uh, one short sentence, Max. <clears throat> I didn't have the guts to write that I wanted to meet her. Ah, bittersweet memories of youth. Must be Tomoko. Excuse me, you have a visitor. Hmm. Monkey shows up. Hey, how did you know where I'm staying? I didn't even have to look it up. Never mind that. Is Four Eyes here? No. Did something happen? Why would Four Eyes be here? Turns out he was dipping into city office money. Holy shit. What? To make up for losses, he'd been going around borrowing money from acquaintances, but I guess he finally made a run for it. Jesus. Why would he come borrow money from a total stranger like me? He has information you want, so I thought he might have come to sell it to you. Hmm. How to use money? What? So he's embezzling? What on earth could Four Eyes have used that money for? Who knows, but he'd been mentioning that money was tight. Hard to believe that he'd actually embezzle, though. Jeez. Uh... Hmm. The information I want is Shiori's location. He knows where Shiori is? Well, he knows where Professor Fumino is. Right, and the professor would know where she's gone. We're all looking for four eyes. In that case, I better help out. Okay. Uh, let's think. Somewhere four eyes might go. All I can think of is Cat Cafe. There's probably one around Matsui Station. Anyway, how are you doing today? Hope you're doing well. Doing pretty fine myself. There's a thunderstorm going on. Currently, so you might hear that in the background. Uh, so sorry about that. I have no idea where Four Eyes might go. Hmm. Hmm, is that... The man in front of the souvenir shop. Doesn't he look like Four Eyes from behind? I'm such a lucky guy. Four Eyes was right in front of me. He goes into the souvenir shop. Oh damn, he's so hard up for money he's planning to rob the place. Wait, really? I call out to Four Eyes, who's headed for the cash register. Hey, Four Eyes! It's not Four Eyes, it's someone else. 
That, that doesn't look like four eyes. Uh, excuse me, I thought you were someone else. Sorry. I scramble out of the shop. Uh, my phone pings. It's a text from Monkey. Four eyes texted me. I'll forward it to you. Watanabe. Look at the forwarded text. I'm finished. I'd like to eat something delicious before I go. Tanaka. What does he mean, something delicious? Uh, he's at Kamiarian. Before I go... I'm afraid he's gonna... hurt himself. I'll start looking here. I'm walking to Kamiarian. Sanpei comes over. Welcome. Hey, I'm looking for someone. I look around the shop, but Four Eyes isn't there. It looks like Four Eyes isn't here. When I try to leave, Sanpei stands in my way. What? You can't just leave without eating anything. Alright, then... Uh, Yamata no Orochi Soba as usual, right? Coming right up. Oh my god. Sanpik heads into the back. Hey, I don't have time for this, but I'm here anyway. I might as well eat it. Jeez. Uh, Sanpei brings over the Yamata no Orochi Soba. God, I'm so hungry. Thanks. <clears throat> I end up eating the entire Yamata no Orochi Soba. I'm stuffed. No, wait. I don't have time for this. Do we pay? Another text from Monkey. Four eyes texted me, so I'll forward it. Watanabe. Now what? Look at the forwarded text. I'm already done for. I'd like to see the beautiful scenery of Matsui before I go. Uh, maybe he's at Lake Shinji, right? Or the park. Uh, hmm. Or maybe the boat ride? Nah, he's not here. Uh, let's try the park. Do, do, do. Park, park. Oh, it's right here. I missed it like two times. If you want to see some beautiful scenery, this is the place. I look outside from the central tower. It's a beautiful town. I can really see why I left Kadio Hearn fell in love with it. I look around, but there's no sign of four eyes. Monkey, Shorty, Snappy, Bitch, Fatty, and Ishihara come over. You guys thought he might be here too? But it looks like he isn't. It's a text from him. Monkey shows me the text. It'd be nice to see my favorite memorable spot before I go. The memorable spot for all of us. Tanaka. Memorable spot. They all exchange glances. Well, do you know where? Where he is? Memorable place. Where's memorable, uh, memorable spot for four eyes? I wouldn't know. The high school, maybe? Like Shinji, don't you think? No matter who I ask, I only get iffy answers. Uh, maybe a favorite place. Let's try changing our approach. Forget memorable spots, what about places four eyes would just plain like? Like somewhere with lots of cats? I saw lots of stray cats behind the city office. Uh, four eyes feeds those stray cats. What's more, he hasn't shown up at the city office today. I'm guessing he's not going there, near there right now. I've never gone behind the city office in the first place. Me either. Damn, doesn't look like this is the direction to go. Alright, uh, Matsui Castle. 
By the way, I'm impressed we all ended up in the same spot. There must be lots of other places with beautiful scenery. Uh, there's definitely pl uh, plenty of superb scenic spots in Matsui, but we all know that if you have to pick one, it's Matsui Castle. It's common knowledge. I think he uh, probably sent that text with the purpose of getting us all to come here. I see. For I must really want all the classmates to come. Hmm. Let's think. That guy's brightest moments were in high school. If so, his memorable spot must be... I'll try asking everyone if they can think of some place they all went in high school. Oh, okay. Wait. I... What? Uh, do you guys... Uh, do you have anywhere particularly memorable from your high school days? Uh, in the spring of senior year, we all went on a day trip. It was to Izumo Grand Shrine and Hiromizaki Shrine. You can't commit suicide there. I know. I'm sure it's Hinomizaki Lighthouse. Okay, so he is planning to commit suicide? Why there? It's surrounded by a cliff. Jeez, that must be it. Let's get going. Oh, why would he be texting us? Unless he doesn't actually want to commit suicide. Uh, we came to Matsui Shinjiko Onsen Station. Uh, we got on the Ichibata train. Wouldn't a car have been faster? He doesn't have the balls to kill himself. Wow. He just wants to give us a hard time. He was always annoying, but I guess people don't change. The train arrives at Izumo Taishame Station. We came to Hinomizaki Lighthouse. It looks like we made it in time. Your classmates are all here. Uh, I was a former genius of Matsuyoba High School. And I am now about to write the final period on my left. Life. Excuse me. My fallen life. My pitiful life. You had us all come here to tell us that? Stop causing such a fuss. I'm busy, you know. I'll catch him. Monkey walks towards him. If you come near me, I'll jump. Monkey, don't. Ugh, fine. Monkey stops where he is. I dipped into the city's office of money. I need to rate uh, 3 million yen before we're audited. Or else I'll be arrested. Why? Wait, why would you do that? Being arrested isn't the end of the world. I'd rather die than be arrested. Uh, let's ask about his embezzlement. What exactly would he be charged with? Corporate embezzlement, he'll probably face disciplinary action and be sued for damages on top of that. Uh, Tanaka. That's what he's saying, but what should we do? I guess we've all got a lot of money. But it's 3 million yen. We've got to make it work somehow. You'll lend it to me? God, we'll make it work. Does he really deserve this money? In that case, I've decided to live. Oh my god. Faraz comes back. The classmates are gathered, talking. I got caught up in something funny. Can you pitch in a little too? Why should I give any money? 
If four eyes dies, you lose your lead for finding Shiori. But I don't have any money. How much could you contribute? Are you serious? It'll take a while, but four eyes will pay you back. How about one million yen? That's a third. There's no way I can lend that much. It doesn't have to be cash. Is there anything you could sell? Hell no. Fuck that. Uh. Hmm. Maybe this? From my pocket, I take out the Lake Shinji badge I got from the Seven Delicacies of Lake Shinji Stamp Rally. A badge? What are you, a kid? Hey, this is a limited edition. I'm finished. You probably won't be able to find Shiori Yoshioka either. Uh, could I see that badge? I show him the Lake Shinji badge. This is the elusive Lake Shinji badge. You're right, this would sell for a lot. Really? Hell yeah, it's a limited edition. That's right, it is. I know someone who would pay a lot for it. Please go sell this off by the end of the day. Can you go, uh, can you do that? They'll buy it for cash. Hmm. Hey, isn't this... A childhood friend works here. Someone you snapped at, huh? Morita, you're in there, right? Uh, the door opens and Morita pokes his head out. <laughs> if you wish to enter, show me that. I need to talk to you. I'm coming in. Snappy shoves her way into the research lab. Huh? You can get in just like that? <laughs> this whole time, I fall Snappy into the research lab. I take out the Lake Shinji badge and show it to Morita. I need to sell this. Are you interested? Mm, this is pretty rare. How much will you buy it for? Uh, for a friend of Snappy's, I'll cut you a deal and give you 800,000. Come on, give us a little more. Well then, 850,000. We need 1 million yen. That's impossible. Absolutely impossible. Come on, a little higher. Alright. 900,000. And not 1 yen more. That's fine. Let's take it. That's 100,000 yen short. You can pay that much out of your own pocket. Ugh, fine. I hand Moita the badge and receive his payment. Man, I'm just getting... Uh, I'm just getting scammed. We arrive at Waterworks. How is it? We got it somehow. I hand the money to Four Eyes. I don't know what I'd do without my old classmates. I was never one of your classmates. I get annoyed, but the other seven are relaxed. Getting together here makes me think of old times. We sure had fun back then. We talked so long, it got dark out. Oh, bitch talked and we listened, but yeah. We were all so young. Stop saying it like you were old. Well, just a little. The classmates are smiling. Relaxing here is fine, but I have something I want to ask for eyes. What is it? You look so scary. I'm not good with these things. Hey, I just bailed you out, friend. I was looking for you in order to find this out. I'll have to hand I'll have you answer me no matter what. 
Where the fuck is uh, Professor Fumino? You know where Fumino is, don't you? I do. He came to the city office to file paperwork when he moved. Tell me. Fumino is in a nursing home in Oda City. A nursing home? Hey, let's all go visit Fumino. Nice. That wasn't very satisfying somehow, but I finally know where Fumino is. Hmm. Uh, changing trains, we make our way towards the nursing home where Fumino is. We're just having an adventure today. There's still one mystery though. Why didn't the 11th letter have a cancellation stamp? What's the matter? You seem lost in thought. Out of the letters she already sent me, one didn't have a cancellation stamp. I can't seem to solve that mystery. I just had a weird theory pop up in my head. Did did Shiori kill Yoko? The postal worker forgot to stamp it, right? That really doesn't happen. Maybe. We're here. At least not in the US, I don't, I don't think. A nursing home stands next to the seashore. So Fumino is here, huh? And Shiori? A caregiver shows us to the backyard. The gentleman in the wheelchair is Mr. Fumino. Seated in a wheelchair, Professor Fumino is looking at the garden with a calm expression. I think he looks a little older. I don't know. Uh, Mr. Fumino, do you remember us? Fumino looks at everyone's faces. Of course I do. You all look well. Uh, Mr. Fumino, nice to meet you. I used to be pen pals with Shiori. My name is... Max? How did you know? I heard about you from Shiori. She was waiting for you this whole time. Where is she? She was working here until yesterday. Everyone looks surprised and shaken. Where is Shiori now? She'll be on a flight to Africa right now. What? She's going to be a medical volunteer in Africa. We just missed her. If only we'd come a little sooner. Man, she left a message for you all. What did she already say? She said there were some tough times. Uh, but my high school life was my biggest treasure. Thank you, everyone. I wish I could apologize to Shiori. It can't be helped. She's no longer in Japan. Uh... Uh, the one who killed Shiori. It said in her letter that she'd kill someone. Do you know what she meant? Oh, she killed... Okay. It's probably about the fire. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. What happened? The fire was caused by a short circuit. She regretted not checking on it despite knowing we had some bad wiring. I see. She always wanted to meet you, you know. I wanted to meet her too. If only I was a little earlier. Or I, if only I was a day earlier. 
on the train ride home, I could scarcely form coherent thoughts. I wonder if I'll ever be able to see her. <sighs> well, that was it. That was the ending of Root Letter. I don't think that was a very satisfying ending, but... Uh, yeah, I can only play through one ending. I did enjoy that. It was very... It was a sweet story. It wasn't, like, action-packed or anything, but... Well, the investigations kind of made it action-packed. And I thought that was a really cool aspect. Uh, it was an interesting story, and I think... Uh, the style, the uh, style of the investigation, how dramatic it was, uh, made it more interesting. It felt, uh, if you've ever played Danganronpa, it was kind of like that. Uh, yeah, that was Root Letter. Oh, there's more. Uh, I walked through the hustle and bustle of Tokyo. I returned to Tokyo and finally opened my own dream office. She already slowly faded from my memory. Then one day, someone knocks on my office door. Yes? When I open the door, my mother is standing there. Mom, what's the matter? I brought you this letter. Take the letter from my mother. It's from Africa. My mother brought a letter that arrived at my parents' house. The sender is... Turn the letter over and it says Shiori Yoshioka as the sender. It's on an elephant pattern stationery.海の教授から話を聞きました。みんなで会いに来てくれたと知り、とても嬉しかったです。マックス君、騙していてごめんなさい。私は海の綾ではなく吉岡しおりです。しおりとしてマックス君に会いたかった。今私はアフリカの国々を転々としています。アフリカの医療はとても遅れていて、日本では考えられないような生活です。でも私はここでやっていきます。みんなが頼ってくれるので、それを裏切ることはできません。寂しいけど、マックス君とは。幻の天フレンドでお会いしまいそうです。高校3年の時、私はまだ子供でした。今思い出すと後悔ばかりです。あなたの手紙は私の唯一の心の支えでした。一言お礼を言わせてください。ありがとう。そして。Uh, goodbye, take good care of yourself. I put the letter away. Anatomy, Kono Monogatari, Sudeto, 
Alright, so that wasn't the final ending, but I don't think I can uh, finish them all. But uh, I do hope you enjoyed. We finished the crossing path through. So yeah, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I'll see you next time. Bye.